Warning, this video features one or more ships that are primarily acquired through gambling mechanics. The chance of winning such ships is very low, and there's no guarantee that you will win regardless of how many times you gamble. If you think you might have a problem with gambling addiction, please stop the video and seek help immediately. Greetings everyone and welcome back to another Starship Review. Today we're going to take a look at the Section 31 Command Heavy Battlecruiser, which is normally only available as a reward from a promo choice box, but has been recently added to a new MUD bundle. This is a very popular ship and likely needs no introduction. I've seen many accounts online of people using their event campaign Reward 3 to get this ship on Reddit, on Twitter, on YouTube, and elsewhere. Command is far and away the best specialization right now, and the Section 31 Battlecruiser is one of the better command ships, so the popularity makes sense. Sporting a 5-3 weapon layout, which isn't necessarily an advantage, a full command specialization with secondary lieutenant intel seat, four tactical console slots, and some free pets in the form of a unique swarm mode, it certainly has the goods. One sore spot is the fixed instant engineering seat, the Commander Engineering Command isn't a huge problem as you can use Call Emergency Artillery, Concentrate Firepower, one of the two Engineering Control abilities, and Emergency Power to Engines. The rest of the seating is just fine and the Intel seating does give you a small boost if you want to do energy weapons, which is where the 5-3 weapon layout would be helpful. The trait Secret Mission has a rather unique effect. It randomly marks a nearby enemy as your secret target, which will have a resistance debuff. If you kill this enemy, you will summon some attack drones to attack other enemies. It's a fun trait that performs decently. The console Forge Turncoat gives you crit severity and weapon power. The clicky confuses then disables an enemy while increasing damage to the target. The crit severity is quite useful and the clicky can be good for big targets like attack cube. In terms of rating, it gets 5 stars for meta. An argument could be made that a 4-4 layout would be better so you can get another mine. But there are several good dual beam bank sets bonuses that you can use with a 5-3 layout. The instant engineering is annoying but hardly a deal breaker. Overall, it's a real powerhouse. For the ship score, I also give it 5 stars. If you watch Discovery Season 2, then you'll know they did a great job with this ship. The swarm mode and the dark mode, which I didn't even mention until now, are both very thematic and really cool. In terms of accessories, I'll give it 4 stars. The trait and console are both good, but not great. They fall into that huge category of stuff that's really good, but it's not the best, so you don't hear about it much and it doesn't show up in a lot of builds. And that's my review for the Section 31 Command Heavy Battlecruiser. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you very much for watching, take care of yourselves, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.